Which free 5 star oh. standard character should you choose? Nice. Genshin Impact giving away a free standard banner character on the anniversary has always been a meme and a dream within the community. Considering Genshin is perceived as less generous compared to its competitors. Therefore, when Hoyovers announced that they'd give a free 5 star on every anniversary starting in 2024 anniversary, many travelers were delighted. If players are wondering which 5 star is worth getting from Genshin Impact S anniversary, this article will list the pros and cons of each character, and the significance of their constellations. So, whether you're getting AC0 or copies, you'll get the information you need. 1. Tynery Tynery and Genshin Impact Tynery is one of the best characters from the standard banner in Genshin Impact. Even after the release of powerful Dendro DPS, he's still relevant if you need a quick swap damage dealer to pair with your Quicken team. Tynery can dish out massive damage with only a few seconds of effort. 2. Mona Mona in Genshin Impact Although there are other powerful buffers in Genshin Impact, like Farina, Mona remains one of the best supports due to her simple buffing ability that doesn't require building up. Ensure your team is ready to deal burst damage, then use Mona's ULT to apply Omen on enemies. Afterward, the hit that comes next, preferably Melt or Vaporize, will be insanely buffed, allowing travelers to deal over a million damage. 3. Jean Jean and Genshin Impact Even though there are many other healers in Genshin Impact, Jean is still highly relevant and excels in her niche. Additionally, unlike some characters on this list, Jean's value continues to rise with her constellations, so it's worth collecting her copies slowly. Not to mention that she's one of the most beloved characters, being the first leader players meet when they first start the game in Mondstadt. 4. Kaching Kaching and Genshin Impact Kaching rediscovers her value with the release of Dendro in Genshin Impact 3.0. Now, her fast multi-hit gets even stronger, allowing Kaching fans to bring her back into the spiral abyss. 5. Dialek Dialek and Genshin Impact Dialek was the most adored character in Genshin Impact 1.0, but his stardom quickly faded when Hu Tao was released shortly after. Although he's now overshadowed by other pyro DPS, He's still an amazing starter unit to have if you're new to Teyvat. 6. Chi-Chi Chi-Chi and Genshin Impact When one questions solely the capability of healing, Chi-Chi is far from useless. In fact, she's still one of the best healers there is. Sadly, other characters are equipped with additional abilities, making Chi-Chi less favored in Genshin Impact. 7. Dihaya Dihaya and Genshin Impact it's sad that Dihaya didn't live up to her potential due to some weird design choices from the developer. She could have been an amazing tanker and sub-DPS with slight tinkering of her kit, but it feels like Hoyaverse gave up on her midway. And last thing is Genshin Impact meta not too much important, just build or play anything you like. Thank you and have a good day. I'm Ghostel.